Hey everyone, Stephanie here, coffee drinker, book lover, and reviewer of many things. And today I want to tell you about the Halloween book box, age four to six, and it is about $35. <laughs> this one I think is one of my favorites. Oh, I don't know. Can I say that? I like all of them. Um, this one has the Wipe Clean Halloween Activity Book. This one is fun. I like this one. Like, I got this book for me before my kid was old enough to play with it. So I have this book. And every page has something to do on it. There's either a maze or connect the dots or find the blah, 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 finish the bats, and so on and so forth. And I love white clean books. I like having the opportunity to do them again and again every year. Um, even though I like, I know the answer, obviously they're not super hard activities, but they're still really fun. Second book in this box is Trick or Treat Parakeet because we need something about trick or treating, duh. This is a super cute book. Okay, so Trick or Treat Parakeet, it says, It's Halloween and Parakeet is busy carving pumpkins and icing spooky treats. But when her friends come to call, they get a shock. Is that a ghost? Who answers the door? A funny rhyming story, especially written to develop phenomics Phenomic awareness, oh my gosh, that's so hard to say, with lively illustrations, this book is ideal for reading aloud to for children who are beginning to read for themselves. I have this book um, somewhere. <laughs> I have this book somewhere, and whenever I got it, I was like, oh, it's so cute! Um, it made me so happy, and... That is the second book in this book box. The third book in this book box is The Pumpkin Who Was Afraid of the Dark. Oh my goodness. The Pumpkin Who Was Afraid of the Dark. Looks super cute. And I was like, it seems very Halloween. Yeah, this cute little pumpkin. Who doesn't like pumpkins around this time of year? Um, and... It just, it, the pictures, look at the pictures. They look adorable. It says, little pumpkin, Boo. Boo is his name. Doesn't like Halloween. Will the little boy she meets help her overcome her fear so she can truly shine? Um, so this one is good for kids that might be a little weary of trick-or-treating. Um. Maybe they were afraid of costumes. And I went ahead and threw in a fourth book in this one to make it a roughly thir uh, $35. And I added um, the little coloring Halloween book. That's the end of this video. Um, I hope you like this video. If this, if this box was for you and um, you're like, oh, I need that for my kid, go down into the description and um, there will be a link that will take you to my Paper Pie website and you will you can get all of the books that I just showed you. Um, I will also leave the link to my really long list of um, book recommendations for the Halloween fall time in case you want those instead. Um, up to you to go through them. It is a long list, so just know that if you click on that one, you'll have to scroll for a while. And if you click on the title of the book or the picture of the book, um, it should take you to more information about that book. Yeah. Um, make sure that your event says, like under event, it says Halloween box or it might only show Halloween 
it depends on if it shortens it or not. And my name is Stephanie Godfrey, so please make sure that you see that before you check out. Um, like this video if you like this video. Uh, give me a thumbs up by liking this video. Comment below if this video helped you. If you've already um, got Halloween books for this year, what are they? I want to know. Um, <laughs> and um, do you have any Halloween book suggestions for me? I would appreciate that. I love Halloween books. They're like, if this is my favorite time of year. Ghosts. 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 Um, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Um, if you're not sure if you want to subscribe, you can check out my face down here and go see my other videos. I make a lot of different content. Um, I just I just do what I want to do. I don't care about anything else. But um, if you subscribe, then it um, gives you a note. I was like, what, what am I trying to say? Sometimes it'll give you a notification and be like, hey. Stephanie posted something new or a, a coffee drinkers review has posted something new. That's what I'll say because that's my name on YouTube. And share this video because someone else might need this box. I will see you on, oh, yeah, I'll see you on my next video. Bye.